Well, that's right. And when the polls do close, the ballot boxes will be brought here to be tallied. At one of the largest polls in Hart County, turnout was sparse but steady. And with the nation's eyes on the race for U.S. Senate, it's expected to be a close one. Republicans are six seats away from winning. I think they're competitive in about 10 of them. Probably strongly favored in about seven, including Georgia, which meant they could flip the Senate. And the Republicans are counting on flipping the Senate. Businessman David Perdue told WYFF News 4 he feels good about his prospects after touring the state recently. He has campaign volunteers making calls and taking people to the polls. The people in Washington, the career politicians, have really made a mess of things, and I just don't think it makes sense to send one back up there to help create the mess in the first place. Greg Dolan from Congressman Jack Kingston's campaign says Election Day has been going great for them. He says they're encouraged by early voting numbers and says it's volunteers that provide Kingston his energy. We have a, a great support of volunteers. We have a really good network that we've been working on putting together since the beginning. and. They've come out in force again for us, and Jack has really appreciated that. Whoever wits will face Democrat Michelle Nunn in the fall. And Nunn's name may sound familiar. She's the daughter of former Senator Sam Nunn. Mandy Gaither, WYFF News 4, live in Hartwell, Georgia. Right now, strong.